This is Dr. Nancy Mullen attempting to bring you the perfect video on methionine and methylation and how methyl groups are formed and what they're for. This is not going to be a perfect video, I have to tell you. Um, and I want to refer you to my website, which is Nancy, N-A-N-C-Y, Mullen, M as in Mary, U-L-L-A-N, M as in medical, D as in doctor, dot com. You'll find an ebook on there that's very, um, very important for, that has a lot of basic information, some of which I'm going to cover in this video. I'm going to keep, this is actually going to be a series of videos. I'm going to keep them short, and you'll see... You may hear various interruptions, like dogs running through and things like that. There was nothing, there was nothing I could do about it, maybe, but they seem to be asleep now. In any case, methionine is a really important amino acid. It is an essential amino acid, meaning that it is an amino acid that you need to it needs to be in your food. You need to take it in from the outside um, in order to have it in your body. Your body can't put it together itself. Your body can't uh, generate it on its own. So, but where methionine, methionine comes from chicken, I mean, it's in many protein plants. It has to be a high protein source and your body needs to be able to digest that protein in order for methionine to show up in your tissues or in the in your amino acid levels but it's in chicken beef fish ham pork eggs cottage cheese liver soybeans soy protein even in vegetable patties, sardines, milk, and yogurt. But you have to be able to digest it. And if your methionine is low, it may be that you're not digesting it or you're not eating enough protein. In any case, methionine has in it a sulfur group and a methyl group. This methyl group is a one carbon, three hydrogen molecule that is tremendously important for your body's function. It's one of, um, one of a number of small molecules, like for example, hydrogen, H2, uh, oxygen, O2, um, Nitric oxide, which is important for blood vessel dilation. Uh, there are a number of small molecule water, H2O. And there are a number of small molecules that are really important for your body's function. And one of them is methyl, a methyl group. One carbon, three hydrogens. When it attaches to another molecule, it may activate that molecule, may deactivate it, or change it in some profoundly important way. Uh, if you have too many methyl groups for your body, if your body, if you are either supplementing too many methyl groups or you you are you have too many for your for your body's biochemistry, you'll experience something like bipolar disorder or one or another difficulty. If you have too few, you are not going to be able to do important chemical reactions. So you need you need just like Goldilocks, you need you need it just right. Um, all right, I'm going to keep, this is going to be a series of videos, and I'm going to keep them short, because 
Uh, my limit is five minutes, and we've already hit that. So you can go on to video number two. Thanks so much for your attention, and I hope to keep the distractions to a minimum, but you never know. Bye.